Happy Thursday, everyone. Thanks for joining the Thursday Three with Victory, and thank you for your support. I've heard from lots of you, and uh, I enjoy the feedback. And I will tell you, today's episode is the number one question that I've gotten, and that is, how do we find resources to make our business uh, a better business? And so, first of all, I want to thank Bob Shantz at Spanish Lake Blacksmith uh, outside of St. Louis for uh, showing me the resources he has on his website. So, everyone, if you go to SpanishLake.com, you can find... This is a worksheet that you can print out and you can take with you uh, during your business day or weekly and you can fill out information that you will need to enter into the spreadsheets to figure out if your business is profitable uh, or how much you need to be charging to get profitable. Uh, so this is a nice tool to have with you and you can fill it in, uh, make up your own categories on the back, whatever you want to do, attract your volume, etc. The second thing, if you go to SpanishLake.com, I'll just show you on my laptop, you can go and uh, find the Excel file uh, for the uh, expenses and download that file. And every time you change a number in the green uh, or in one of the columns, you it actually recalculates what you should charge to be profitable in your business based on your expenses and your volume. Uh, the next thing I wanted to touch on, the American Farriers Journal. If you don't get the Amer American Farriers Journal, you should. Uh, there is, this is, uh, November of 2020. Um, they produced the Farrier Supplies and Services Guide. And if you go into the November of 2020, um, issue, it has your cost to shoe a horse determines your financial success by Jeremy McGovern. This is Pat Broadus and Danvers Child. It's their clinic presentation on business. So if you go to that, you will see everything that uh, is written down in that clinic to figure out your business expenses. Then the next thing, if you go to the next article, it's full-time farrier income skyrockets. Well, the charts that come in that in that article give you statistics that you should know and will help you with your business because it gives you regional statistics for farriers around the country and how much they charge. Uh, and in your area, if you're not, uh, you know, close to or above that, you need to rethink your business plan. The last thing is the Blacksmith's Guide to Financial Freedom. This is Andrew DeVisser's book and you can find it. I downloaded it on my Kindle, and you can find it on Amazon. You can find it at bookstores or order it, and that will give you, it's a nice short read that gives you lots of tips for how to run a profitable business and uh, and just how to set up yourself so that you can retire in this business and things to do to set aside money and save money. Um, so, just wanted to give you guys those tips and those resources. Keep watching the series, and uh, we'll see you next week. Thanks.